Hey, this is Chuck from Lord of Delahead. Today we're gonna make a quick and easy pasta puttanesca, all right? What we have over here, we have a tomato, we have a red onion, we have some basil, some garlic. I got a tomato that I already chopped up and mixed with some basil. I have some olives, capers, and anchovy, some olive oil, all right? All right, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna uh, cut this onion. Maybe you want to go over here. You want to watch me through the onion? Or? All right. So I'm gonna dice the onion. First, I cut it this way. Then cut it this way. The ribs are. This knife isn't that sharp, but it's all right. And then go like this. Cut it across this way. And you get a nice dice. All right. That's enough onion. Okay. A little. What do you need? Oh. You, you, what do you need? Oil? Take the oil. Go ahead. Take the oil. Okay. Little tip. If you notice, when I was cutting the onion, the cutting board was sliding around. That's because we forgot to put a rag under it. It's always good to get a get a damp rag, put it under your cutting board, and then the cutting board is not going to move around. Okay. All right, you have the olive oil back there. Okay, so the onions, the onions cut. Let's put the onions. Go. Okay, now we're gonna cut the tomato, and we're gonna dice it the same way. First, I'm gonna go like this. Not all the way though. You want to leave the back part together so it doesn't come apart. And then I'm gonna go like this. Okay, and then you cut it across like this and you get a nice dice, all right? Take a pile of that, and then dice the rest. All right, next we're gonna get a couple of garlic cloves, and we're gonna cut these up. Give it a little dice, mince it up, small. Hey, that's a very nice bracelet you got there, buddy. Oh, this is this here, this old thing. My daughter made me this. It's made out of I don't even know elastics. You like it? Very sexy. Yes. Okay. All right. So now we have our onions, our tomatoes, our garlic, and I'm gonna chop up some olives. Okay. Chop them up. I'm gonna chop up some. We're gonna give them a rough chop. We're gonna put one still there. Let's give the olives a nice rough chop, okay? Okay. I need your olives. All right. Put the olives aside now. Okay. So now, onions, tomatoes, garlic, and olives. Now, I cleaned off the cut board. Got a couple little fishies there, a couple of anchovies, and we're just gonna give those a little chop. Alright. We'll put that, put that into a little little container for when we're ready. Here we go. Alright. Very nice. All right. Okay, now we're gonna put some olive oil. In a saute pan, a little swirl, and we're going to put that right on the fire and let it heat up. In goes the garlic, and we're going to let that saute. How long do you want that to saute for? I want that to, to, start, to start to sizzle a little bit, but not burn. When you, when you can kind of smell the garlic toasting in the olive oil, that's when I think that I'm ready to put the next uh, ingredient. Excellent egg. Go. Okay, our garlic, see how it's sizzling? Now we're gonna add our onions that we chopped up. And I think now is a good time to give a little salt and pepper that I already had mixed up. And let the onions and the garlic sweat together a little bit. Go. Okay, now I'm gonna hit it with my olives that I chopped up. There are your olives, okay? Next. I got capers. I'm not gonna put all these capers in. I just wanna 
Put a few cases in. Sprinkle the infield. Now, by inch over, a little salty, a little salty umami from the fish. Let all that cook together, let all the flavors come together for a little bit. We're on. You can smell, you can smell the anchovies. Smell the cake from the anchovies. Smell it. Mmm. Smell it. I smell it. Uh, okay. Now, I'm gonna put these tomatoes in because we already mixed these with the basil. All right. Beautiful. Give that a call. Finish it off with a little, a little of this at the end. And that's Here it. we go. That's it, folks. Oh, yeah, give it a little ping. Beautiful. Here we go. There's a Putinesca. Make it nice. All right. So we got the finished product. My man Mario is going to do a taste yeah. test. Let's see what he thinks. Usually Mario doesn't have a lot of nice things to say, so <laughs> let's see. Mm. Good. Is it good? Is it good? Let me taste it. It's a little hot. Come on, nice. Yeah. Beautiful. Not that I ever doubted myself, but I need a little. Sometimes I impress myself. I think the steam is making your scalp sweat. <laughs> <laughs> 
Maybe. Ciao. Thank you.